Hello and welcome back to Dark Souls 2. We just reload the internet map. Now, how the fudge? And what the fudge can we expect? Okay, there's loot around. I don't see a singular bell. But me not seeing a bell doesn't mean that there is no bell. Oh, yeah, there's the bell. Okay, cool. Let's... Fuck off. I did not know to expect that. As may be understood from my expression of strong dissatisfaction with the whole situation. No bells! This is not time to ring some random bells. This is not what the game is about. No. No casting. No spells. No bells. I don't have time for your spells and bells. Not on such nonsense. That's just silly. I will take none of that. But now I have no way to soften those guys down, so. Good for me. I suppose I was kind of hoping that this would have been the end of the road. You know, with no additional nonsense behind it. And no such luck. Come on. You both know you want to dance. Now follow me to the dance floor. But that was still in range apparently. Alright, do you wanna dance here? Alright, I don't think both of them will follow me to this room. If I'm lucky. One of them will back off. Nope, ni neither of them backed off this time. I guess last time one of them just got stuck in a ball or something. This is a completely reasonable way of life, you know? Getting stuck in a ball. Oh yeah, there, there one goes. Guess he was jealous. Because I was only dancing with this guy. Yeah. I can completely understand that. Okay, now we want that second crate shield. For collection purposes, you know? Give it to me. No? Okay. What an asshole. Okay, I think we can just... Go in here and run. Okay, this is not a direction with a bell. We need to find the direction with a bell and stop the ringer. No, this is a summoning sign. Summoning place, even. This is a bell. But someone already ranked the other one, so... No big difference there. Alright. Can I just leave? Oh, I can connect these. Nice. So, even if we don't find the next bonfire, we don't have to go back into the down that ditch. It kinda looks like we're gonna find the next bonfire. Dark Knight Stone? Tell me about it. 
Because I don't remember seeing it before. Abuse equipment with dark. Okay, yeah, that's not gonna help me a lot. What are you doing up there? Bloody Nascon. If I wait for the bells to stop ringing, does that help anything? No, probably not. No ringing! God damn asshole. Is there an additional ringer somewhere? I really didn't appreciate any of that ringing. Give me that, yeah. Thanks. Blue flame. Hmm. Sounds nifty, but is it actually any good? Who knows? Okay, do you have another, another ringer somewhere? Because I don't like ringers. As evidenced by me continuously slaughtering ringers. Right? That's evidence enough, right? Right? You? You wanna go? Mate? And apparently not. Alright. Huh. I didn't realize they had access to more than pyromancers. And there's a dragon rider and two of those other knights. If I were to simply try to aggro uh, only one at a time, would it work? No, but they don't bring the dragon rider, so we're still good. We are still good. It's a good thing that block the uh, block breaking thingy doesn't actually deal any damage if you're not blocking. Apparently, I was blocking. That was an issue. Yeah, this on the other hand is a problem. Let me just heal up a little bit. Really. Thank you. Right. Also, they can block whenever. Forget about that. Sorry, I need to have a little bit... Oh, yeah! And that apparently is a side effect of blocking. Or being attacked while blocking, that's the one. Alright, uh, I guess you want some of this, some of this, some of this... Yeah? Right? Don't tell me you have another ringer around. Because I'd be really pissed off at that. If you did. Okay, never mind. I suppose I'll just go ahead and take a little rest here, have a little drink, make a little love. Now shields are actually necessary here because I don't have a distraction. Right, also... But I don't have is enough health. Currently. Okay. That is a temporary thing there. You can get health back. Okay, now we need to back off. To get some stamina, not to get impaled with an axe. Thank you. I do appreciate the offer though.
Right, right. Got some more? I'll give you some more. Here you go. Good thing your hitbox is amazingly large. Because I wasn't expecting that to hit. At all. Right, so... I suppose I should test them all. That's a chest. I'm gonna open it. It's a Dark Knight stone again. I'm not sure if that's any good. Another chest. I'm gonna open it. For poisoned rowing knives. No, those are in fact no good for me. Okay, you. Still a chest. Open up. What you've got is a torch. Four torches. Still a chest? I was just... Okay, fine. I was really sure one of them was were supposed to be mimic. Key. A fragment bench of your. Okay. Awesome. Now there's a f there's a fog wall here. Should we human up first? See if there's anything to summon. Because I don't know if we're gonna need to fight anything. We might have to fight something. No, I see nothing here to summon. I'm gonna take a look around. Just in case it's like a hidden thingy, machingi. Like maybe it's at the bell. Let's remember not to hit the bell. Because we too are capable of hitting the bell. And I was so prepared to lock on to that bugger. Maybe at the top of the staircase? No. What's making all that ruckus? Is it the fire? Shouldn't be the fire. Alright, I guess we're just running off into the fog. Sounds perfectly safe. Perfectly safe indeed. Alright, so it wasn't perfectly safe. There is actually a boss fight in here. That is an awesome outfit. Do you have a fucking bell as your weapon? Fuck off! No bells, no spells! Those were the deal! That was the deal! No spells, no bells, okay? And you get the Nobel's prize. Whoop. <laughs> if you use no bells, no spells. Alright? Cool. Because that was fun. It was a terrible bun, but it was a it was one. So I'm satisfied. As long as it was a bun, even a terrible one, I am satisfied. No fucking bells, no fucking spells. If you're gonna cast a spell, I'm gonna be really cross with you, dude. Really cross. It's not even gonna be funny how gross it will be with you. That's a spell! No spells! Oh. I said no spells, no bells! Fuck off! You heard me say no bells or spells. Come on. And you're using both. You're using bells and you're using spells. Fuck off. Alright, apparently the bell spell is actually really efficient at killing me, so fuck off even further. So your own cock up your ass so deep you don't even remember where it's actually from. That doesn't actually make any sense.
Uh, but neither does it not honoring our deal. The deal was no spells, no bells. God damn it. That was more than one spell there. I am not satisfied with the results of that battle. Especially due to the high amount of spells. And bells. <sighs> no one honors a deal these days. Which one of you wants to go, mate? Well? Come on, one of you should want to go. Thank you. This is a bit of a silly approach, but you know, I'll take it. That's like noob chivalry combat. Except in that case, he would have also have blocked there. I did not expect to do the jumping attack again. The jumping attack will remain a mystery to me. Yo, you. Come on. Let's go, mate. Wait, I needed to step away from my companion. Thank you. Fuck off! Okay. Seriously. Do fuck off. <sighs> okay, where are you fallen? I'm gonna wait here. I'm not gonna advance. Okay. I did advance a little bit. But that was because that, that, that asshole there was being an asshole. Right? Okay, cool. No. Fuck off. Fuck off, fuck off, fuck off. It's fun song now. Okay, maybe a shield is a good idea. I don't know. Maybe. The whole issue was because I was trying to switch to Estes flasks. Which didn't work out for the best. Because I accidentally switched to a shield. And then I accidentally almost got killed. I don't know, I get used to actually using a gamepad. Okay. Fuck off. Alright, he's probably got me now. Yep. Alright, oh, because it bypasses blocks. Fuck off. That was enough. Fuck off. I'm currently very, very salty. And this is why I affectionately refer to this game as Dork Swords. Because it ends up with a very dorky sword. Wait, no. Very salty dork. That's the one. Ah! Alright. Which one of you wants to go again? Hmm? Oh, you wanna go. Both of you wanna go now. That's completely different from our previous approach when neither of you wanted to dance. Fuck off. I said fuck off. Thank you. Now I have your pants. Now I only miss your hat. Yeah, wanna go mate? I don't. Fuck off. Yeah, that, that's all you got? Huh? Huh? That's all you got? Well, because honestly, I don't even get, have that much right now. Sorry about that. Yeah, well. Suppose a life gem will do. Alright, there's this guy before we can start uh, taking on the whole magical affair on the other side. Uh, please don't hurt my Dorchi. Please don't push my Dorchi towards me. 
My Torchy is my friend. And my Torchy is eternal. Right. I keep forgetting that the actual beginning of the dodge cycle is when the invincibility frames are. So, yeah. Alright, dodge is staying out of the way. I'm gonna scum lord. Which I still feel is rather fair for this situation. So let's be fair, those guys would also scum lot. Give me the chance. Right. Don't get hit by that, thank you. Don't want Torchy to get hurt. You know? Because Torchy is our friend. Right. And there goes another spell. And there goes another shot, so... Shit. I'm not sure how much damage that dealt me. I didn't actually see a yellow line there. Alright, Torch, we're ready to go. Follow me. We have, in fact, got this. And we got the summon E! Did I miss that? There we go. Uh, Devotee Scarlet, please don't hurt my Torchy. Oh, you say hi to Torchy? Okay, that works. And then she kills Torchy. <sighs> Fine. I guess I'm gonna pick up the torch from Torchy. Let's go. That AI will be useful to me. I hope. Maybe. That AI might be useful to me. Let's go with that one instead. Human, do not produce light. Light. And all will be buried. I'm welcome in this place. But I'm allowed to come and pick this up, right? Awesome. Yeah. Who are you? I am Agdain. Guardian of the crypt. Countless dead rest here in peace, cradled by the comfort of dark. Light only agitates. We have no need for it here. I am a finito. We weave death and watch over the dead. This task was granted to me. By the one who gave us the first to death. Countless souls rest here. Some of them from ages long ago. Some were rich, others poor. Some wise, some dull, but now... They're all just dead. Did you come for him? The one called Fendrick? You will find him deeper inside. Many castle servants and the like have come to fetch their lord. But they rest here now, put to death by the king's own guards. Perhaps he's not in the mood for company. In the past, humans were one with the dark. The former King of Light, he feared humans. Feared that they would usher in an age of dark. How queer are you humans? How you go on, never separating the truth from fiction. This place is welcome to all, provided due reverence is shown. Death is equitable, accepting. We will all one day be welcomed by her embrace. Tell me what you desire. Show me reverence, and I will lend you my hand. Ooh. What's that? The Ring of Thorns plus one? That's a lot of human effigies. What is that? Oh, an Elizabeth mushroom. Huh. Yeah, we talked about this. Thank you. Some are crude human. 
Do as you please. Was he supposed to buy something? Maybe he would actually have helped us then? Maybe. Anyway, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Right, uh, someone is shagging in that cart over there. It distracts me from my uh, battle with uh, Lucatil's brother.